Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'll be down. Just so you can identify yourself. Have you got anything in your pocket that you shouldn't have? Anything that can hurt us or anything that can hurt you? No? Right, uh, okay. Do you know why we're here? No. Oh. Why are you here? What? What are you doing here at this time? I'm waiting for a mate. A mate? Yeah? Who is How it? old's the mate? What? How old is 20 the odd. 20 odd? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. How old are you, buddy? Me? 20? Yeah. yeah. And your birthday is on the 19th of this month, correct? Yeah. Yeah. So how old's your mate again? I've got the full chat box. 20. 20. Another chance? Do you want to really tell us the truth or are you just going to carry on with this story? I'm what you're meeting a mate. Right, okay. What's the mate called? Jason Jackson. Alright, okay. Well, he's not here, is he? So... We know what you're here at this time for. You do now, don't you? No. No? Right, we're catching online predators. We identify online sexual predators who choose to prey sexually upon children under the age of 16. We've got uh, the Innocence Project here as well. And we've got Fleetwood Interceptors here as well. So, do you want to explain why you're talking to children online? Mm -hmm. I'm not. You're not? Mm -hmm. What is your name? What? What's your name? Shane Confield. Is it, yeah? Have you yeah. got any ID on you? What? Have you got any ID on you? No. No? You, t you said your name was Lee on your Facebook profile, didn't you? I ain't got it on your profile. Mm, yeah. I'm waiting for the mate. It was this lady you were talking to. We've got the whole chat log. 14 year olds. Have you got your phone on you? It's best what? if you no. just be truthful. Have you got, not got a phone on you now? Oh, what was yours in there? Have we, we got, got you? Have we got a phone number? That's me, but it ain't my profile. <laughs> Why are you here then? What? That's, a, that's an amazing coincidence. Where, where's Jason coming from? What? Where's Jason coming from? He's on his way through from living Barnsley. From Barnsley? On bus. What, what time? On what? On bus. Oh, on bus. On a train station. On a train? Yeah. What type of train do you win? What? what? I don't know. It so just says come down and I'll meet you down at train station. What time at? What? What time at? I don't know. Okay. So Should we what? ring your eight, phone eight, then? then? this morning. Huh? You've been here since 8, 9 o'clock this morning, just on the off chance this train's going to come in from Barnsley. How did you not be down at this time to huh? meet Jason? Don't know what time is doing. It's just a coincidence that we're all here at the same time as you are, when there's reputedly a girl coming over of a train coming to meet you, who you've been talking to. Right, just to let you know now, police have been called. You are going to be arrested for um, sexual communications with a child under the age of 16 years of age. You started off, um, you said that your name's Lee Harrison. No, I ain't got a first look up as that. No, uh, but really your name's Shane Harrison. Your birthday is 90 for the 6th, 1997, and you're from Crofton. You've messaged um, some decoys. Fortunately, not real girls on this account. Hi sexy, so replies back, hi, you single, yeah I'm 14, you said that you're from Wakefield, you want a boyfriend? No, I ain't put no like that. Just thinking about you, and you send a picture of an erect penis. That ain't me. Is it not? Um, well if it's not you, you'll be able to explain that to the police, because we know it is you, you might want to think about a trim as well, gay guy. <laughs> it was your seventh message actually sent straight through was an erect penis. Wow. wow. No reply to that because she's a kid. Answer me. And then she says, oh my god, why did you send that? What did you send that for? For you. Okay, okay. That, that was a bit random. Um, I've never seen one before. Well, you will with me. Answer me. You're getting a bit common this answer me. You're getting a bit authority for the child. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but I told you I'm only 14 and you say you're from Crofton. Hi sexy, what are you up to? Just got home from school. You then sang on Friday night, later on, at 23.18, 
a video of yourself masturbating. That all sounding familiar? No. No? Okay then. You know this video we used in course, so if you're going to be telling lies, it, you're going to get a longer sentence. Just, tell Just be truthful. Say where you want to go, you go on this, then um, it, it'll go more likely with the judge. We've got the pictures with your face and everything. And we don't come on unless we've got 100% evidence, mate. So it's within your best interest now. So reverting back to this video of yourself masturbating. Put, put your leg down, mate. Put your leg down. Keep your hands away from It was actually in a public toilet because, listening to the video, you can hear a toilet flush next door. You can hear a toilet door opening, a bloke washing his hands under the hand dryer, and the door going out as you're smashing one out. Nice. I thought that as well. <laughs> the video lasts for 2 minutes and 29 seconds, um, culminating in you ejaculating all over yourself. What did you have to say about that? Can I just say as well, um, just, did you, this J Jason did you say his name, yeah. what do you mean? Have you told him what you're wearing today? What? Did you tell him what you're wearing today or do you know you that well? He knows me that well. Right, so how come you've told us you're going to be meeting a child in grey jeans, Grey hoodie, blue trainers. Literally, I've got no profile up as that. Right, what's it? Well, you've turned up in a grey hoodie, grey jeans, and blue trainers. What you've just told a child you're going to meet her here at five o'clock. The time is five o'clock. We're here. You're here. You're wearing exactly the same clothes you just described to her. What's your name again? Shane. Shane. Okay, listen, Shane. How long have you been in this train station? Not that long. Yeah. Not that long. Because we have information that you've been here since 3 o'clock. No. No. So what time did you arrive at the train station? About half hour. About half So you've been waiting half an hour? Yeah. So you're still denying that this is anything to do with you? I've literally had nothing to do with all. You know what to do with this? No. No. So you don't know nothing. Where's your, where's your phone? What? Well, I ain't got one. You ain't got one? How oh, have you been texting the decoy? What? How oh, did your mate tell you to come away at the train station then? So I've used the mate's phone. Alright. Oh, where's that mate gone? What? Where's that mate gone? Get rid of the phone. Who's the there then? You got one in your back pocket? No. Yeah, yeah, what's this? Sir? Right, this will be handed over to the police. Put it inside the... Just his... Um... See if there's any ID. It will be handed over to the police. Is that Say it that, that's that's, that's oh. the woman's. Is that your mother's? Yeah. How come you got your mother's um, details? My, mo my money goes in. Right. So you've got nothing with ID on? No. Oh. That is DWP appointment card, is that? Just on the back yeah. of that. Shane, you're just best being truthful, you know. There is also you know, messages honestly. reverting. I know this could be a bit wild, but um, I'll be able to get a free bus pass to meet you because I'm signing on. Is that your free bus pass? I've had that ages. Right, so you do have I, a free I bus pass. I get it off at Job Centre because right, I'm listen, job Shane, centre yeah. listen, Shane. You do know by telling the truth, it'll go a lot further for you. By lying and denying it, you will end up in jail. And you know what the mech of people like you inside? Probation. Probation? Are you on probation? probation? Yes. What for? What? What for? I'm not saying. Is there anything to do with talking any to children online by any chance? No. no. Anything to do with children at all? Anything? What? Is it a sexual offence that you're on probation for? No, yeah. you change your name as well. You've got a deed of a change of name there. <laughs> Are you sure you've not got always, any previous... Lee, then. What? Always Lee. That one with previous name. Oh, Isn't right, so you, oh, right, so, so now we're getting somewhere, so it's you're now known. Right. So you were Lee then? But you it was, so it, it is your profile. Your profile so. under Lee. Yeah, what, what was the name of the mate? What, Jason Jackson? Yeah, yeah. Um, a lady comes to my page who knows you. Two, two ladies, to be honest. And she gives me your real name. Oh right, West, oh, Shane Cranfield. Yeah, yeah, now so we, we, know, know, we, know, we, we are getting somewhere now. now let's see what this is. It's harassment. Like harassment. Yeah, I've had what? Oh, yeah, right. yeah, was that against right. a young girl by any chance? I've had, I've had words. Yeah. So, and your name, your name on here is actually Shane Cranfield. Yeah, that, that's what yeah. I'm, that's my proper name. That's what I've depolled it to. So who were you harassing then, Shane? What? Who was you harassing? It's been there just since that would happen. I mean, you're on probation, that's not yeah, good, is it? Yeah, no. Right, um, after this masturbation video, what do you think of that? So on, on 27th of March, Shane, you were got done for harassment. Yeah? Yeah. 
So it wasn't that long ago, was it? No. It, so it, you have got previous for preying on people then? No, yeah. Well, harassment, it, that's what that means. Who is it you're harassing? Uh, harassment is mainly contacting someone that I shouldn't have been. Exactly. Well, exactly, well, you're, you're and you've done that again. Which is someone on full upset. Yeah, but you've been doing that now as well. You've been contacting someone that you shouldn't be. How long were they? What? How old were they? 50-odd. One of my old mates that started winding me up. So where's your phone? What? Where's your phone? I've got you up one but I haven't got a SIM card in. Oh, right, now we're getting some Right, right. Have an right so, so, have so, so a bit ago, you didn't have no phone, your name wasn't Shane. Can you just pass me, take your hands out of your pockets for me, buddy? Where, where's your phone, mate? Let's just be honest now, give me your phone. It will be handed over to the place. Yeah, it's right. right. my mate's that. Okay, well, it's always your mate. You, you, what, 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 mate is it? What? What, mate, what mate does it belong to? That one that makes it in the hotel. What's it, what's it called? Gareth. Gareth what? We don't know his last name. Oh, that's a funny picture. Was that oh, oh God. What, you've got the decoy as your screen <laughs> saver. Oh, 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 you've blown yourself oh, sky oh, high. Come on. <laughs> what, come on. Right, okay, so why, why are you in possession of somebody's phone <laughs> with a picture of the decoy that you've been speaking to? Because I've only bothered it. You borrowed it. I thought you borrowed it to come down and do and go on. Was you going to come and meet me for your, for your mate, meet the decoy and all that? Your lies are just ridiculous. Too, then, yeah. yeah. Your mate will be questioned. So, so, so who do you want to get done for this? You or your friend? Mm. Ain't me. Ain't you. So, what's your mate's name? Just have a look at the screen server on this phone, please, decoy. Well, he's giving you a phone, <laughs> but you don't know his second name at all. That's it. It's Oh, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a bit fatter. <coughs> this is the lady you've been speaking to. I'm a bit older, you know. I think. How does that make you feel? It wasn't and even a child. We've had two other girls that have come that you've been speaking to. So how many more is there? I've been speaking to no one. It's, it's, it's better for you now, mate. Where's the that you've been talking to? All right, it's here. It's there. There's 1.9 thousand people watching it. It'd be better if you were honest. I thought you haven't been speaking to no one. OK. Right. You're so, making yourself look really stupid. We, we, well, it's all right. Let's well, just quote yeah, a bit more of this. The chat, yeah. So we, we finished this audible masturbation video in the public toilet. Yeah. We've got pictures of you. What do you think of that? That's all for you. But I'm only 14. It's all scary. So do you want me as a boyfriend? It says, don't you mind me being 14? No, baby. So we getting together then. Why would you want to get together with a 14 year old? Like I say, I don't know a lot about this. Okay. Send me, a pic send me a sexy picture of you. What? A naked picture of you. No way, it's rude. Look what I sent you. But why send them? Because I can. Can I ask him a question as well? You said you were texting your mate before. What's, what's the passcode to get in it? What? What's the passcode to get in it? I don't know because I didn't have that one. Obviously, when we use it Wi Fi, it won't. No, it's just yeah, but you, never still need to get into, you still need to get into it to be yeah, able to. Yeah, but because I always had it on. I didn't sort of scream. Do you think we're all stupid, yeah. Shane? Do you think we're stupid, yeah. mates? Yeah. Come on. We all have no yeah, been <laughs> Jesus. So, how, how did we know then that your real name's Shane, even though you've denied it, but we also know you as Lee Harrison on your profiles? Bit wrong, how do we know your birthday? How do we know where you were from? How do we know you were going to turn up today in a grey trackie? Grey jeans, blue trainers. How do we know at five o'clock we'd be at this time, at this place? Exactly, coincidentally, the same time as somebody turns up with your description in a grey hoodie, grey jeans, blue trainers, five o'clock at this place. Can't answer that one, can you? Stuck now, aren't you? You need to just tell the truth. Gets worse, this chat, by the way, as well. Yeah. Did you think it was just going to be five minutes? I was feeling if it was a father that turned up. <laughs> they wouldn't be. They wouldn't be doing this. Actually, what would he do <clears> if a real kid had turned up? Well, well that, that's, that's a dread thing. thing. I, think, yeah. I think we really know what he we, would have we, done. We, we know what he wants to get. What he wants to do yeah. to her, don't we? You're not going to have a really nice birthday this year, are you? You're, gonna have a nice you're probably going to get sure. sent back to prison because you're, you're on probation. You might get a present, but I bet it's not a present you get betting. And only this time the tables will be turned. You won't be the one dishing it out. There'll be somebody bigger and harder, literally, that will be dishing it out to you. Do you feel threatened by us at all? We're, we're not going to harm we're you, gonna hurt anyway. you in any way. No. Apart from exposing what you. you're doing and um, playing on children. Are you well known in this area? Huh? Are you well known in this area? No. no. You will be now. You exactly. will be now because there's 2,000 on this live and that was. 
How many have we same. got, Cheryl? You then send the decoy, the same decoy that is your screen Is your father in jail? What? Is your father in jail? I'm not saying no. I'll tell you that as a yes, sir. That's a yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. So, like I said, you send a non-sexual selfie of yourself to the decoy, the same decoy that you've got as a screen server on your phone. Sure. You are very sexy. Are you still a vagina? Ryan's seen that, love. So, go through. Do you feel like you need yes to admit it? Yes or no? Yeah. What are you on about? You a vagina? Or have you had sex before? No I sex or a vagina. So I presume you meant virgin. <coughs> so she says, of course I'm a virgin. I'm 14. Okay, so when can we meet up then? Wakefield, question marks. What we're going to do? Please we'll go to mine. Um, so you're going to meet here at this station at this said time. Do you want to have sex with you when you come and see me, baby? I'm scared it will hurt. It won't. I'll do it slowly to you. Answer me. There's quite a lot of this answer me, isn't they putting your foot down throughout all this? Um, How come, can I ask just why you're not being like that with us? You say you get turned on by a 14 year old child. Kids. Yeah. She says, what do you mean by turned on? Get it's a good now, thing. Yeah, absolutely. She said, I feel strange, I've never met a man before. Don't, don't worry, I will look yeah, after guys, you, baby. Get sharing this video, please. Get it shared far and wide. I'll be on my own. Yeah, this video, guys. How are you going to be on you your own when you're meeting your friend, are you? Police are here now, right, guys. Police are here now. Evening. All right, just let you all know, uh, I am recording all right. It's That's fine, yeah. yeah. No problem, guys. Um, We're recording as well, obviously. Yeah, I can see yeah. that. Yeah, no worries. Um, what's going on, please? He's here to meet a 14-year-old child for sex. He's currently on right. probation as well. Right, OK. We've, um, we've all obviously got his... Took his phone off him just because they were uh, obviously rooting in his pockets so we could quite easily destroy the evidence. Right, OK, no worries. Um, we've got full evidence path of, of right. the Right, OK, do me a favour, pal. You're going to come with me, OK, right now. I'm going to sit you in my car. Um, who's got all the details, please? We've got an evidence pack. Yeah, can uh, just take it off. Whoever's got all the details, just come with me. And I'm on my own at the moment. Yeah, that's right. What's your name, my friend? This guy was also going to get the 14 year old girl pregnant, he told her. Yeah, hi guys, this is Mike from the Ursus Project Northwest. Um, just like to get this 14 year old pregnant. I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going Just share the video as much as you can, guys. Keep sharing, guys. Thanks for being absolutely amazing okay. as well. They always are. Right. Oh my, have we got to move all the details? Yeah, over there. She's coming over. Yeah, she's coming over. Yeah, the police are being grace. Yeah, so he's too mine. happy um, now. I mean, keep on coming just in case, but as it stands, it's fairly peaceful here. Um, I know what I'm on with, I've spoken to the side of this, so I'll, uh, I'll keep you both here. Um, right, sorry about that. I was just, uh, my DCI just wanted to know what's going on. So, um, what's your name? I just can't do it. I've just got it. Can you, can you just back up? Yeah, yeah, I'll go over. Out the way, Raquel gives the details. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah, guys, so that was relatively easy, relatively quick. Um, 
basically looked like a rabbit caught in headlights when I fired everything at him that he was here at that time fitting that description um, said he was going to be on his own he's now said he's come to meet a mate bang to rights and then um, he must really have it bad for this decoy we're having as a screensaver he's also going to get a pregnant to just sat down as well yeah I didn't get through all of it um, he said he wants to get mm -hmm. pregnant um, we can have a baby together it means I'll have my mind set on um, so we, we can be a family baby answer me and this answer me become very very prominent throughout the whole chat when he wasn't hearing what he wanted to um, say so we've got one decoy on him if anybody else any information on him he goes by the name of Lee Harrison over Facebook um, we now also know his real name of Shane um, he's tried to change names several times that's obviously I think down to um, maybe the past history of his father and trying to get a separate identity from that again that's unconfirmed by us um, anybody information message our page please we'll forward all the relevant details on to you we know that he was messaging two girls that he was not at college with but knew him from the college um, they portrayed themselves then and as, as 15 year old girls uh, very very similar conversation throughout um, he sent pictures and videos and stuff to these other girls they were getting pregnant as yeah. well yeah they were getting yeah. pregnant um, he declared his name he said I'm not sure we now know who he is this is your chance baby I mean I want you and get you pregnant I'm not getting pregnant at 15 um, so he's asking for sexual intercourse with a child again how many kids do you want baby answer me relays when his birthday is um, he said he's had sex before but there was 16 he said so nobody at 15 then no but who gives a shit not me so I mean you can see the mentality he's not bothered about that um, I just wonder what was his previous yeah, I smoke weed but he's cutting it out he doesn't drink he wants to make love with them all and I, I will F you all over come and meet me so we can have sex together answer me sorry to bother you um, Normanton have a top police station can you attend there Yes, um, yeah, yeah. So you know what yeah. that is? Yeah, yeah, it's uh, the, big, park, the big one up on the building. Yeah, yeah. 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 over round about. That's, That's right, yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. Oh, oh, thank you, officer. So we'll just, we'll just video him get, going away. Oh. Enjoy the weekend. Happy birthday. I'm just going to say that. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear <laughs> Shane or Lee or whatever. You dirty Hope you boy. enjoy prison stew. <laughs> <laughs> We've been that big. He's putting his seatbelt on. Happy yeah. birthday. Yeah. Bye, yeah. Shane. Yeah. Come back. Right, guys, I know we did a little bit of irony on there, but he wasn't co coherent with us so much, so let's just give him it. And while I've got this opportunity, I'm just going to put something out from yesterday. I know there's been a lot of stuff over the internet. Yesterday's sting that was carried out in Newport, the live was intended to be just simply for a private group, um, as the, the other group that assisted in this matter don't go live and have a brilliant rapport with the police down there. So to respect how they work, we said we'd just put the live feed on a private group so it could be used as evidence, should it need to be, if anything went untowards. Um, the life was leaked from within the group and this has been dealt with and dealt with promptly. The predator informed us, and the first B backed this up, that uh, claims of his age were not 17, but it was actually 23. Um, that sounds to me more like the actions of a predator realising that 17 is a whole new ball game, both morally, morally, morally and legally. Yeah, um, and he, knew, he knew what he was doing, also using the excuse of destroyed the device containing the evidence. Again, proving he knew exactly what he was doing and that he was in the shit. Um, when, he, when the police arrested him, he admitted to the police he was 23 years old and upon him they found two devices. And then he turned around to the team that was down there and said, yes, I lied throughout the whole lot to you guys. Um, we could have handled it better. Yeah, we can handle everything better. We're learning through this. Every sting is different. We will do our best. The main thing is a predator is off the streets. If you choose to want to slag the team off and anybody else who work with us, that's your prerogative. I personally am not bothered. The job's done. He's off the streets. Um, other people that want to jump on board and try and slay us, mm -hmm. speak to us first. Yeah, put on reviews Mess messages. on. Messages. Reviews on. We've got a page. Informed. You know where we're from. You know who I am. I'm JP Hunt and I don't care. 
come and message me personally and I'll speak to you about it. Then if you form an opinion and want to slag us off, that's your prerogative then, you didn't fully aware of all the facts. I ain't got a problem with that. If people don't like us, don't like us. People like the way we do things, do it. End of the day, predators off the street. We, we had one yesterday as well, a predator off the street, literally was off the street, we're on a frigging roof. It's not what I meant, but end of the day, that's what we're doing and we're going to carry on doing it. And I thank everybody so much for the support and the well wishes and stuff on this. And we've learnt a little bit from yesterday, we're learning as we go along. Anybody who says they're perfect doing this, absolute bollocks, because you never know how a thing's going to work out. And I, just, I just want to say, like, you know, from, from the Innocence Project Northwest point of view, the, the, the team, I've worked with them a couple of times now, I've actually asked to work with them, they're probably one of the most professional teams I've worked with. Absolute professionals. Yeah, so Thank you for that, Mike. It's appreciated. Yeah, thanks, mate. Um, again, the guys that we saw at the Stings, um, 200 people in excess yesterday. I know that was a crazy one and probably never see again. And every single member out there from every faith, every community that were there, it took us longer to shake everybody's hands afterwards for exposing a predator in their environment. And that's the people that really matter. It's the public out there that you're, you're saving their families from these predators. And that is what we'll do. Um, again, can I say thank you to Fleetwood Interceptors and for um, Innocence Project for coming along and helping us out today. Enforcers, Jay! Well, I told you I'm learning every time, I'm not perfect. You, have it. you will not have Interceptors. I think you should change it to Interceptors, it sounds better. But again, apologies for that, but honestly, Fleetwood Enforcers, massive respect to them guys, brilliant team. Um, Any time that we can assist them, I'm glad to help out. Same with Innocence Project. We'll help out. We'll help anybody out there, providing the reasons are right, and we're getting these predators off the street. That's what it's about. Um, all this politics and slagging off. I've had my spout. That's me done. I ain't going to continue with it. I'm not going to carry on. I'm sticking up for our team, and I love our team. And our team is brilliant. Yes. Um, I love your team as well. And the guys that work <laughs> with us, fantastic people, absolute salt of the earth guys, and we've all got the same objective here. That's help keep us kids safe and get rid of these predators. Uh, so above that, again, thanks to everybody who supported us along the way and continue to support us, and it's really, really appreciated. Yeah, thanks, guys. Uh, we'll keep everybody updated on the progress of this one. Um, it could be a lot interesting, and as in most cases, when you hand them over for what the crimes that we find them on, it's amazing what I gets think, on earth. Yeah, afterwards. I think a can of worms is going to come out on Shane, and uh, definitely. So. so as I say, thanks again, guys. Thanks to everybody today. Much appreciated. Thanks, guys. Um, and we'll speak to you all soon because we're going to be very, very busy. Yep. Bye, guys. Keep sharing, flowing.